Hello, my lovely people. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Jen. If this is the first time that you are seeing me, I thank you so much. Oh, I thank you. I know my auntie in particular don't like it that I am driving now, and one of my other subscribers. My people don't want me, but uh, I'm not going far, and I follow the crooked um, small small way. I don't get in the beltway, so God is with me. We pray, we pray, and we just keep going. <clears throat> so I saw, hey, hey, God. Mm. This video about this lawyer that is helping David Undain, and they are asking, uh, they are asking him all kinds of stuff and all this. This David is, is the David of our time. Oh, is the David of our time, and there's nothing anybody can do about it. People can yab him. People can say anything they want to say when you are doing something that I know that I will not be able to do. Hmm? Even if I have 10, 10 gen on top of my name, hmm? I take up my hat for you. Talk of hat. It's getting cold here. We have to wear hats. Hmm? We have to put on hats. It's getting cold. Because you know cold starts from the head. <sighs> it's too much. So they are asking this lawyer, the one that worked with David, about why America, America is not talking about uh, the criminal of uh, Hamede Bolatinov. Listen to it. So, my people, eh? Did you expect that America will pay attention? America will not pay attention because guess what? Everything, everything that we want America to talk about, everything that we want them to say, everything that we are looking for in America for them to give us, FBI, or CIA, all this and that and that, is right there in Nigeria. So, if the Nigerian government, Nigerian uh, 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 law enforcement cannot give it to us, why should you come from America? So they released uh, a couple of days before they released the, the stuff. They released it like they promised on the 31st. Ananugo came out and bragged. Ananugo came out and bragged and called uh, obedient names. And Anugo came out and called obedient names and called Atiku people names and said, yes, that they, they have lost their case in, uh, in America. You know, whenever they want to do their criminal, they, they come out ahead because they know what is coming ahead. They pleaded with, with these people, said, please, you will mess up my name or if you bring this thing out, you will mess up my name. Please don't bring it out. Then they will come out and said, hey, the, uh, uh, America has said that they will not release anything. You guys have lost. Shame on them. These people don't even have any shame. Jesus is Lord. These people don't have any kind of shame. They brag about something that they're not supposed to brag about. They brag about criminality. They are bragging that FBI did not release uh, uh, the criminal record of Ahmed Bolatinubu, my brothers and my sisters in Christ. Please, is it something to brag about? Is it something to brag about? Eh? Why are they bragging about it? It's just to deceive gullible people in Nigeria. It's just to deceive those 119 Naira people that they give a recharge card. But they cannot deceive people like me now. They cannot deceive millions and millions of Nigeria uh, out there. They cannot. Those days are gone. He came out and said that uh, 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 um, Tinubu won them Atiku and Obi in, in the court in the United States. Jesus. I was sh The people, I was so ashamed for them. My, their shame was just shaming me. Because there are some things that you don't open your mouth to say. That is, you go and hide under the toilet to, to say it. You don't come out and say it. So for those of you that are waiting, that America will come and be talking about your problem. Or will come and fight your battle. They have even done well. They have done well by releasing the Chicago University. So that we know that America, Paul Latinobu, is a forger. So that we know that America, Paul Latinobu, did not go to school. So that we know that everything that we know. That is correct. They have done us well. This is not something that you didn't know. Because when he started running before, some people, some smart people started challenging it. They started challenging it from God knows when. God bless the heart of that man. He has passed away now. 
But they started challenging it for a very, very long time. So if they're challenging it right there in Nigeria, that means it has been happening in Nigeria. It's not a new thing. There is nothing that we are looking for outside that's not already inside there. It's just that the people, the criminals refuse to bring it out. They know everything. They know everything. So I even thank them. I thank them a lot for... I thank them a lot for bringing out the one that they bring. So then, as soon as Ananu go, the useless Ananu go, the hopeless, jobless Ananu go, that they were so scared that they have to come out and say something because if if Atunubu has to be removed, all of them will be removed. All of, every one of them, they will be removed. So that's why when you saw Ahmed Obal Atunubu, they, they were glued on the television to see if they are if they are abracabra, abracabra, abracadabra that they did in Supreme Court will work. And as soon as they finished, they showed them. They said, oh, "Okay, now your job is safe." <laughs> they are working for their money. Don't think they are working for you. They are working for their money. So we looking for uh, Obodo Yibo people to come and give us something that will persecute this man. You see how the man said, he said the people don't care. And when they brought the uh, uh, FBI brought the thing, the headline, the headline mentioned Ahmed of Balatinubu. So every other place that they has his name, they, they will cancel it. They use a biro and pen and ink and whatever they have and cancel it and darken it. But you know, when you're a criminal, you will show even no matter whatever you use to cover it. But this man is telling you that um, African problem, that African problem is not a priority for America. That America has a lot going on. The only thing they care about is when, when that their interest is being messed with, they will put them out. But who is your president? They don't give an F about you. The man who said it, the lawyer said it. And you know why they, they covered the name? They will give us a little bit, a little bit uh, of what he did in, in America. They will save for him. They will save for him so that they can use what they have on him to get everything they need from him. And anyone that he refuses to give them, they will bring the rest of them. Those ones that they, that they use ink to, to cover, then they will use eraser to clean the ink, clean the ink and show it to us. And did you think that Ahmed Bolatinobu will ever not give them what they are looking for. He will give them everything that he's looking for because he knows that his life depends on it. So they don't give they don't give an F about you. So stop thinking that um, America or UK, all these people, oh, they should bring something that will help you uh, nail him. You already have it. If your people in Nigeria did not give it to you, it's not their fault. If your people in Nigeria refuse to persecute him, it's not their fault. So let them hold what they are holding. Unfortunately, it's the wealth of Nigeria that this man is going to go and drain to pay for his crime. It is the oil of Nigeria that this man will drain to pay for his crime. But we are, this video, if you don't learn anything about it, this David and a, a friend, a lawyer, said really to be honest that africa no no whatever whatever is not the number one priority for america and that's the truth and that's the truth now that the judiciary has made him um a, a, a president they they don't really need to they don't owe us anything they don't. But I thank Nigerians, the ones that refused. I thank Nigerians that refused to give up. I thank Nigerians for the, for refusing, for refusing and saying yes because the court has said that we are going to just take it like that. I thank Nigerians for for being with Pitobi. I thank Nigerians. You guys and you are an awesome. Yes, they have idiots that that are hungry people that they can barely get something to eat so they when you see them yelling and screaming outside about this how they supported Ahmed Bolatinubu 
They are telling Ahmed the Bolatino, but our rights is finished. We'll make you give us money so we can continue to talk. At least you saw during election time that most of them came out after election say, ah, the money that we used to uh, come and 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 um, protest for you, you have not paid us. So we saw criminals so come out. They they banned it. They come out and said that their money has not been paid. That they are paying them uh, uh, thirty thirty thousand. That they have not been paid. Are you for real? This is a country, Nigeria, over. 200 million and that's what we are able to get so stop looking for um help from outside because you're not going to get it you're not going to get help from outside if your country did not give you that help why would you be looking for help outside when what you're looking for outside is in you, inside your chocolate are you okay so that's as soon as i saw that uh, interview uh, i said no this one is what uh, it's what showing for people to know. I thank this lawyer. I thank this lawyer so much. God will bless his heart for at least making Nigerians know what they already know. Making them know that they are not going crazy. Making them know that they are not losing their minds. That what you are seeing is exactly and even worse than what you guys are seeing. And he is uh, doing everything in his power to make sure that he helped David so we can see more of those things that uh, that we don't know about so my people when i saw that i thought i'd come and and show it to you that david is doing such an amazing job don't depend in america to to do anything anything for you because they don't owe you anything they have to keep a little thing now that they will use they have to keep a little thing they will use to be harassing the man if they give you everything waiting concern them and, and nigeria what in concern them and Nigeria? They are even doing us a favor by allowing us to come here. They didn't let the, uh, most of us stay in Nigeria and 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 women. They did not allow that. I thank them. I thank them for that. I thank them for that. And we should not ask too much to tell them. Yes, their hands are in what is happening in Nigeria. Their hands are in it because the government allowed them to put their hands. If the government, who who in the world that is absolutely. How many head do you have that you will want to come and bribe a um, um, president of America? Um, you, uh, are you a, a learner? Are you crazy? You cannot do it. So those ones that they know that they will sell their souls to the devil, sell their children, sell their mother, sell their father, they will offer them money. They will offer them homes. They will offer them everything that they want to offer them and make them sign their life away. And they will be collecting any, any other president that comes that want to challenge them, they say, hey, we signed contract for 200 years. And on that, is that 200 years come, there's nothing any of you can do. So it's up to the Senate of Nigeria now to sit up and know what they are doing. And know what they are doing. Eh? If they don't know what they are doing, <laughs> oh well, election, you guys forgot that now that Nigerians' eyes are open, that election is coming every four years. <laughs> And when that four years come, most of you will go down again. Because people now are wise. People now can see clearly. People now know who you guys are. And including the people from the Labour Party. All of you will go down one by one. All of you will go down one by one. You either go and work for Nigeria or Nigeria that put you there will bring it back down. From me to you. Thank you so much for